Hi, this is Philip Crossland with ThermalThink. Today I'm going to walk you through how to connect your ThermalThink seat once you get it in the mail. The package will come with your seat, of course. And you'll see there it has the, the connector on the back end. There's a zipper pouch. And within that zipper pouch there will be a connector. That's how you connect your seat. There's a five pin connector on here. It will also come with a USB-C uh, and Bluetooth controller. So I can show you what that looks like here. You've got on one end, it's going to look like this, where you have a five pin connector. On the other end, you're going to have a oval USB-C connector. So come with that. It does not come with a battery, but you can select any USB-C power delivery type battery. In this particular one, I have a RAV power. Uh, the capacity is, uh, is 20,000 milliamp hours. And the maximum power that this seat uh, will hold is 36 watts, so this particular Battery comes with 12 volts, 3 amps. So you multiply this together, the volts and the amps, and you get 36 watts. So this will supply the maximum power to this seat. You can select, there's another video I'll have that will show you a bunch of batteries we've tested and different options and how to select your battery. So this particular battery then comes with a USB-C to USB-C connector. And again, this is a USB-C is just an oval shape on both ends. Uh, it doesn't come with one, most do. You can go to Walmart and get them for for very inexpensive, uh, these little adapters. So what you'll do then is just connect that adapter. The first one will be on to the battery itself. We'll have an oval connection for power delivery. And then you just connect the other end into your oval on your Bluetooth controller. And you'll know it's connected because there'll be an LED light that flashes. So there's a blue LED light there, you can see. So the other side then will go right into your seat, this five pin connector, and it's keyed, meaning it can only go in one direction, so you can't screw that up. So your final assembly here will just be your battery to your connector cable right into your seat. And that whole thing can then just, you can zip that right up into your zipper pouch and tuck it away while you're sitting this on your stadium seat or within your golf cart or chair or patio seat or wherever you want to set it, set it on. So that's step one to get it all connected. The next step then is to download the ThermalThink app. So you download your ThermalThink app. And once you get that downloaded, this particular one, I'm, I'm on an Android device, but you can use that as iOS or Android, either one. It's compatible with both. It'll have a connect button. So I don't know if you can see this or not, but there's a, a small little orange connect button. You'll just click connect on that screen. It'll load your system settings and configurations. Uh, it's communicating with the Bluetooth device here. And you'll hit a heat dial. It's a small little heat dial. You can crank that heat dial up. You can see here I just ramped that up to 77%. And from that point on, you can go ahead and start controlling your, your seat. It'll heat up. The, the seat and the back will heat together. Uh, it gets pretty warm. There's also modes on here, so you can set, um, if you're playing so uh, softball in the spring or football in the fall, you can set those different types of modes, or if you use it on your couch, or if you use it in the patio, or if you have a specialized setting that you want to set that at, then you can, you can set these customized heat modes on the app. And that's kind of the true power of using this, the Bluetooth, you know, smart app. It has a hundred different settings. That heat dial, instead of just having three settings, you can set any type of setting you want all the way up to 100. Uh, so that's another neat feature. And then you can name your device. So there's a settings screen. You can go ahead and name your device. Uh, so it's neat, unique to you. Uh, if there's any other devices around, it'll just find your device. So pretty simple to operate and simple, uh, simple to connect. Again, if there's any questions, if you have, um, just you can email us at thermalthink.sales at gmail.com. Um, or you can go onto our website at thermalthink.com and there's, uh, there's the email on there or you can chat with us if we're available uh, during business hours. So there's multiple ways to get in contact with us uh, and ask any questions you may have. So thank you.